Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Root Beer here, and we are starting part B of our 2016 Pascal with question number 11. An oblong number is the number of dots in a rectangular grid with one more row than column. The first four oblong numbers are 2, 6, 12, and 20, represented below. So we've got two rows, one column. Uh, three rows, two columns, four rows, three columns, five rows, four columns of dots. And if you go ahead and multiply these out, one times two is two, two times three is six, three times four is 12, and four times five is 20. And we're being asked, what's the seventh oblong number? Okay. So the general pattern that we can notice is the, the nth oblong number has n dots so it's uh, it's n dots across or n columns and n plus one rows there's always one more row than column and I noticed that for the first one we've got one column for the second one we've got two columns so for the third one we get three columns and that's that's sort of our starting number so it should be n times n plus one which would be n squared plus n, but we're just asked for the seventh one. So seven squared plus seven, that'll be 49 plus seven, and that'll be 56. Or you can just say seven times eight, that would work just fine. But 56, and that is C, so that's what we bubble in. All right, so join me if you are so inclined for question number 12 in the next video.